Thanks, Chris. The teen accused of opening fire inside Cleveland High School in Rio Rancho on Valentine's Day will stay in juvenile detention until he can get a psychological evaluation. News 13's Jackie Kent was at his court hearing today in Sandoval County with details. Jackie. Kim, today here in court, there was a lot of talk about 16-year-old Joshua Owen's mental state. Owen stood silently next to his attorney today as he confirmed Owen is in special ed and has serious mental health issues. The search warrant says Owen claims he was hearing voices that told him to carry out the shooting. Court documents also state Owen wore a ski mask on Thursday morning around 7 when he walked up to three people in a hallway. One person told police Owen pointed a gun at them, but it didn't go off. Another student reported seeing him shoot the gun into the air, then run off. Owen was later found in an arroyo about a mile from campus. That was thanks in part to a text he sent a teacher telling her where he was. Today, Owen's attorney asked that he be released to his parents to make sure he continues to take his medication. They also asked that he undergo a more in-depth mental health evaluation. He's got some serious mental health issues. And so uh, at this point, we want to make sure that we uh, find out everything about Joshua and what happened, uh, what's going on through his mind. But Judge George Eichwald ordered Owen be held in a juvenile detention until that evaluation can be complete for the safety of himself and others. Police did find a so-called hit list that included Owen's ex-girlfriend and others. We did speak with the mother of Owen's ex-girlfriend. She says that he threatened to harm people at the high school a year ago. We'll have much more on that later today on News 13. Kim, back to you. Okay, thank you, Jackie. Of course, we are working to find out what, if anything, the school district did after those incidents were reported to them a year ago.